This is a face pool. So here to set yourself up, you wanna make sure that your cable is right at eye height. Once you get that set to your eye level, you're going to get the rope so that you can get the best range of motion for a face pull. Here, what you're going to do is make sure that your hands are in an overhand grip. If you notice here, my palms are facing down to the ground. They are not facing up towards the ceiling. And that's just so that you can guide this movement mainly with your back. If you put your hands underhand, you're gonna be using a little more of your biceps. So we want to reduce the bicep help and get your back working as much as possible. From there, what you're going to do is you're going to inhale as you bring those hands towards the cable. So as you're stretching out in front of you, you're getting a nice stretch in your back. Go ahead and let your chest cave a little bit so that you can get the most stretch from your back muscles. And then from there, you're going to exhale. You're guiding this movement with your elbows. Again, keeping those hands facing down to the ground. And then you are going to pull this rope right to your ears, okay? You don't want to be having this rope up above your head and you don't want it to be down at your chest or neck. So you're pulling this rope right to your ears. So the rope should be coming right to your eyes where the cable is set up and then you're squeezing your back as much as possible. So from here at this contraction, when your back is fully pulled back, you wanna make sure that your chest is poking out as well. So you want to get your chest out of the way so that your back muscles can get contracted as much as possible. So inhaling forward, get a nice stretch, and then exhale, pull that rope back, squeeze your back and lift that chest. Also be mindful here too, you wanna keep your core nice and tight. You don't wanna be rocking back and forth as you do this movement.